Be much to everyone out there, Ninja Cat Gaming here, and welcome back to Terraria. Um, did it just freeze? Oh, Ninja Cat's Gaming. There, okay. Let's come to here, start game, go on this world. Zoom in. Hmm. Oh crap. What'd I do? How'd I do that? Okay, well, it doesn't look like there's any floating islands anywhere near here. Where did I click? Oh, okay, if you zoom out enough. I'm gonna climb to the top of this tree today. Drink a potion so we were at full health. Alright. Alright, here we are. Alright, there we are. Let's load up a map. Alright, hold on, let me try to double jump up there. Alright. Um, I do not see any edges or anything of a floating island. But, uh, who can tell? <clears throat> the reason why I want to find a floating island is because tend to have lucky horseshoes on them. Nope, I thought I could glitch the game. They tend to have lucky horseshoes on them. And lucky horseshoes are good. I don't know why I'm failing on building. Let's bit higher. Anything, anything at all, please. Nothing yet. Stay back. Physics much bro, question mark? Oh crap. Let's chill out inside of a box made out of dirt, please. I tried to build it, it didn't let me. We can kill the harpy. Hey, we did it. Alright, now hold on.
make a little box made out of dirt that we can have holes in to attack from. You see, whenever the harpies come up this way, I can attack through here. Now let's see whether it works. And if I need to get in or out, I can just do it through here. So I can get out through there. Whenever I come in, I just need to replace this. Not with two blocks. Again, the controls are kind of hard to get used to. Someone used to pressing buttons for as long as they played Terraria. Usually harpies mean we're either too far up for our own good, or we're near a floating island. Hopefully it's choice B, near a floating island. No, well, I tried to drink a potion, but it wouldn't let me. Well, let's try this again. Okay, I don't know why, but it seems different. It seems like it lags for a split second too much. Anything, anything at all. Love the map will load. Okay, well, it doesn't look like it. Okay, well, let's try jumping this general direction. I was trying to do this so that we could zoom out and see the map. Wouldn't let me. <sighs> I've had a first good second pair. This cave looks fun. Let's go explore that. You, you, you slime, stop. Let's take all. Platinum. Platinum is good. <coughs> eh. That was a sneeze, in case you're curious. There's a heart thing down there, and I got almost hit by a boulder. Oh, a boomerang! Take everything in there. There's two heart looking things down here. 
Who, who's Barney? Where is Barney and who is Barney? Also, if you didn't see the house, it's taller now because I made another room for new peoples. Where's Barney? Where's this Barney folk? Oops. Okay. Where is Barney? Because I don't see him. Mine? Ooh, life crystal. Let's replace the dirt with the hard crystals. This way. Two new hearts. Barney the merchant has arrived. Okay, he spawned on that upper part. Means we can go up there later. Let's just uh, put the thingy things there. Death to worms. Well, it's over there. Just don't question the weird yellow glowing. Just stay away from weird yellow glowing. Ooh, sapphires. What, what's a, hold on, there's a red dude. What's a broken heart? <gasps> I got Cupid! Ooh, and he emits light. Don't attack anything though. Switch to the sword. Jesus. There, alright. Oh, that was a mouse. Sorry, mouse. Oh, I got enough of them. I do believe this is more platinum. Can I please just there? Again, you guys, this weekend will be the challenge, along with me dyeing my hair. Also, um, I'm going to reshave the sides of my head, and just have the top of my head grown out, because it can stain, the hair dye can stain your ears, if you get it on there. And I just barely missed an arrow from something, didn't I? There's a boulder in there, so let's not go there just yet. I'm trying to... Cupid, don't start... You can start... You've been bugging out like the whole time I've gotten you. Whoa, cave bat. I thought you were a butterfly. Dead now. Okay, see how I'm just kind of like... Full on everything? What are you? Archery potion. Fun. Oh, there's more tight. There's more. Oh, there's a chest down here. Chest takes first priority because it can contain lot. There's another mirror. And oh crap. Nope. Take everything. Come back up here. Find the titanium. Um, if the cave bat will not do that, then I can mine the stone that's blocking the way. I think this is titanium. titanium. No, it's platinum. This is what we were trying to find in anyways. Platinum. 
Don't know why I started calling it titanium, but my mind is weird. Ask any one of my friends, they will back me up. My mind is probably the weirdest mind you will come across. No comment by you, Jacob, if you watch this. I don't care. We are getting a lot of good stuff this episode. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, there we are. Okay, let's uh please. Just let me let me jump out. Please. There's something red down here. Okay, well that's clearly not going to be able to mine. <gasps> oh, big slime! There we are. And drop. Now we have another heart crystal. Ew, face. So weird looking, Cupid. Let's put this thingy thing away. And trade it out for this. And then also, crap. Let's kind of throw cobwebs away. The knockback on the sword's pretty fun. Is this more platinum? Mm-hmm. There we are. Martin, tap on the potion. Oh, it's a snail! I was like, what the heck is that on that web? Another heart crystal. Oh, well, we need to be home anyway. Sell some of the new loot we got. Shop. Okay. Oh yes, piggy bank. This will be good to have. Oh my inventory's cool. Uh, let's just sell something very simple.
but what's this? A heart arrow. Heart arrow. It's a Valentine ring. Equipable, give it to someone special. Okay then. But um, anyways, the piggy bank. This is a good item to have. Because if you do not know what the piggy bank does, well, it's just like a piggy bank in real life. It holds money. So I can... No, not, not that. Not that. But please, let me select it there. Put it down on the table. I can click it. And I can store my money in there. I can store other stuff in there too, but that's what the chest is for. Use the piggy bank for what it's intended for. This is already a 20-minute video. Oh, I'm gonna sell some of the stuff that I don't really need. Da -na 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 -na. Oh, this has no value. No value. No, I'm not gonna sell that. How much is boomerang worth? Ooh, that's one gold. But it does 13 damage. Hold on, let's move that into there. I don't really like the bows. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and sell that. And a mining helmet. I wanted to buy this. I want to buy this. Which means we can, uh, sell some stuff. And I still have not equipped my cactus pickaxe, which does more stuff than the normal st thing. Shop again. So now we can sell this. Not buy. Sell. But what else does he have? Not a lot. He has an iron hammer, but I can make that. Um, we have upgraded potions. Ah, oh, yes. The second magic mirror. This. Only ten silver. It used to be worth a gold. Ugh. Hmm. Hold on, let me get some valuable stuff out of my chest. Take this. I guess I'll go ahead and sell that also. Ugh. So much to do, so little time. Well, I'll be right back, you guys. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I made a new sword, you guys. It does 16 damage, I do believe. Yes, and it has very fast speed with an average knockback. Um, also, I just realized I could sell some of the stuff I'm wearing that I'm, like, the shackle has really no purpose. And it's worth three silver. Uh, I'll keep that. That increases my movement speed. This makes it to where I can swim. This makes it to where I can double jump. And this makes it to where I can claw climb. How much can I sell the torches for? Nine silver and I have almost a hundred. No thank you. And pets aren't really worth anything. Oh well. I'll have to save up more for the mining helmet, I guess, because it's eight gold. I need more gold. Which means I'm gonna have to find more stuff. Because, I mean, yeah, I could just take everything I'm not going to use and put it in here. That's way I can sell it, but it's not really going to be much. So, um, anyways, uh, I know this episode ended up running kind of long, but again, I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you guys did enjoy this, because it's a fun game to play, it really is, and I hope you guys like watching it. And so, yeah, as soon as I'm done selling these... Ooh, I could get two gold from this, but it's platinum bars. 
And I made a sword out of them. That's fine. I can buy it! Which, if you guys do not know what the mining helmet is, basically, I can put it on. Sure, it's only one defense, but whenever I'm down into a cave, basically, this helmet makes it to where it's not dark. Here, or I'll show you guys a different video. So, let me up. I will see all of you in the next video. Meow.